ABC 5 News at 5 starts now. Oregon's employment numbers are trending upwards. Thanks for choosing NBC 5 News at 5. I'm Derek Strom. Craig Smullen has the night off. Last month, Oregon non-farm payroll employment rose by nearly 4,000 jobs. NBC 5's Lauren Preto spoke with the Oregon Employment Department about what that means for the upcoming months. That's our top story tonight at 5. Lauren? Derek, the Employment Department said in a release that the rise of jobs in December follows a heavy loss of nearly 6,000 jobs in November. December saw the most job gains in the healthcare, social assistance, construction, and of course, retail trade. Construction jobs were at a record high last month with over 123,000 jobs, 500 of which were added for residential building. Guy Tower of the Oregon, De uh, excuse me, the Oregon Employment Department says, even though the pace at which jobs are being added in Oregon has declined since COVID, the employment numbers are going in the right direction. These are still historically low unemployment rates for the state. And we're not quite at that historically low level that we saw uh, just before the COVID pandemic, but we're bouncing along the bottom of some of the lowest rates we've seen, and that's true for the Rogue Valley as well. Oregon's unemployment rate matched the country at 3.7% in December. While the number of jobs increased, December saw losses in financial activities and wholesale trade jobs. Tower told me the Oregon Office of Economic Analysis forecasts about 14,700 jobs to be added in the state over the course of this year, mostly in construction, leisure and hospitality, professional and businesses services, and healthcare. Live in the studio, Lauren Preto, NBC5 News.